What up? It's Zeon coming back at you with Death's Door Part 8. Just grabbing my controller. And you know, we collected all three souls and I already came back to where Death's Door is at. And so let's see what happens when we bestow all three gems to the door. And I just wanted to take a time real quick to say Happy New Year's to 2022. I hope that it is everything that you want it to be and that you have some awesome New Year's resolutions. And yes, this video is a little long. I did not anticipate it to go this long, but hey, that's what happens when you go and fight two bosses. So hell yeah, stick around. And you know, I'm thinking it's probably gonna be a minute until I post my next video just cause I wanna, you know, spice up the channel a little bit. I wanna get a professional intro done. I wanna get an actual profile picture and an intro on the YouTube page itself so you can kind of get an idea of who I am as a person. There's a lot of things to come and I'm coming into this New Year's with some hype. And so, woo, let's go. Enjoy the finale of Death's Door. Oh Lord, something's fishy. We know that the Death's Door guy, uh, the gatekeeper, he's sketch. He was not a good predecessor to the previous ones. You're much stronger Reaper than I. I could have never taken down those giant souls alone. It's time at long last, let us use the force. Let's force this door open, fledgling, and force finish our assignments. What? Let me throw my marbles at it. Just kidding. Dude. My huge souls. It's like it has a health bar. Oh! oh man. We're going. And now to the other side of the death's door? Where the hell? What's on the other side of death? Just kidding. Okay, real fill. Oh, are we gonna see Gan? Not Gandalf. Gan. What? Ganondorf? What the hell? The guy from the Lord of the. Or no. Gandalf. No. Hey, Grid. No, what the fuck? The guy from Harry Potter who passed away. I can't think right now. Dumbledore. This is where it looks like he died. It went to the place beyond where no life is to be seen. Uh, hello? Oh, God. Who's that? He's like, hey. Death! <laughs> He's the guy that's been coming and saying, Are you death? I thought the tales of the original Reaper were just the mad ramblings of the free crows. Yeah, well, I guess that's me. So if you don't know I was real, if you didn't know I was real, that means you're not here to rescue me, huh? <laughs> yeah, he has a noise. No, I'm sorry. We're here for another purpose. In fact, you might be able to help us. Well, rude. But all right. I mean, what could a few more minutes after several centuries be? So why are you here? Actually, how did you even get here? We seek souls beyond that you've passed through death's your door. We are service-bound reapers. We require those souls to finish our tasks and restore our stature within the commission. Otherwise, we will die. Oh, awkward! If you're looking for a soul here, you're out of luck. Any non-corporal souls that pass through the door absorbed into the ether. So energy has to be recycled to create new life. And that's why my job is so important. Not that the living don't hate me for it. Yeah, this trying to just do his job, you know? I used to go around reaping souls myself to pick them up and take them beyond the veil. But it was so depressing. Not for the souls. They don't care. But for the living ones they left behind, I wish I could let them know dying is a scary, it's a cycle of life. Thing is, over the vastness of time, I got tired of that cycle. But then one day, a strange thing came up to me with a proposition. It could create portals, doors, or pl to a place or world. Okay, and then I'm gonna stop with the voice. It's actually hurting my throat. <clears throat> they offer to outsource the collection of souls to an automated system using one of their doors. While it was open, it would draw the souls of the dead, a lighthouse on the shores of the ether, if you will. In return, they asked for their lives to be extended. Okay. 
Well, actually, they asked for immortality, but that's impossible. If souls stick around too long, past their expiry date, with nothing left to tie them to mortality, they decay into demonic forms. All life must end. Well, eventually. Well, eventually. <laughs> So, while I kick back, several generations of these self-proclaimed lords of doors came and went, enjoying their unnaturally long lives, each one agreeing in the end to submit to the limitations of life and go willingly into the ether. Until one didn't. The, the white one. Which brings us to your current lord of doors. Towards the end of what should have been their lifespan, our lord, your lord, betrayed our long-standing agreement. They said there hadn't been some kind of incident, that the door had malfunctioned and needed to be remade anew. For the door to be reconstruction, it would require the touch of death to link the door to the ether. But after this new door was created and opened, the Lord kicked me inside and sealed it shut. No way for me to escape. No way for stray souls to pass onto the ether. No death along the living. Oh, okay. That makes a lot of sense. Okay, that's what happened. And I've been here, alone, ever since. <clears throat> but my assigned soul, it must be here. It has to be here. I tracked it to the store. It must have entered here somehow. Are you sure you haven't seen it? Sorry, guy. If a soul comes in here without a body, it disappears into the ether. Sooner or later, everything that begins has to end. So, there's no hope. There, it must still be here somewhere. No, 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 no. I wasted so many years searching for that soul. Decades, centuries. I refuse to die. Uh-oh. I sense you're a little bit past your best before date. Uh-oh. The Gray Crow? Oh, God. Oh, Lord. Uh, he's like, deuces. Oh, God. Oh, God, fam. Oh god, not like this, fam! Oh, what? Oh god, what? what the hell? That is some crazy shit! How am I supposed to even hit him? Oh my god. He's He's a fast old crow. Are you sure you couldn't be in Betty? You, I feel like you could have been in Betty's ass if you wanted. Yeah, boy. Oh, what? I didn't see the crow. That was an unfair hit. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh lord, oh lord. Come here! Give me, give me some hits! What? What hit me? It's the crows! I don't see the crows that spawn from his body. Jesus. Oh my god, he, he, he was still moving. See, that one came from outside the map, but I still got hit from his body. Death! I wonder what ha Death is right here, though. Whoa. Oh, whenever I hit him, the crows come out. Oh! Oh! Oh, God. Yeah, we're gonna just one run direction. Oh. I feel like his head should be a hitbox. His head should be a hitbox. It totally should. Oh god, what is that? Oh god, what is that? It's sucking me in! It's sucking me in! Okay, we're gonna be here a minute. We're starting off like this. So when he's running at you, there's no way of hitting him. The technical sh- Yeah, right now. I wonder if there's a way to just, like, melt him. Oh god. That was insane. I felt the damage. 
It wasn't even him. It was these baby crows, dude. <laughs> Jesus Christ. It's like third phase and I haven't got hit yet. So let's see what happens. So I, I didn't want to be too greedy now. Woo! Oh! Oh! Am I at the corner of the map? Oh, what is happening? Oh god. Game face! Game face! Game face! Game face! Oh, why did I- why did I go into him? I don't know. Okay! Woo! Right after I said game face. Yeah! C he killed me like, many times, okay? I don't even know if my camera's on. I recorded for like 20 minutes and it was just me fighting him. My lord. I can't tell you how long it's been since I felt a fresh breeze on my face or saw, well, anything. You never appreciate something until it's gone, do you? I saw a lot of that in my job. But until your Lord of Doors locked me up, I thought it would never apply to me. I'm sorry about your big feathered friend back there. It's always hard for the living to let go of the dead. Even more of a rough one, having to reap him yourself. I, I, can I can sort of understand that feeling. Even if it wasn't your intention, you've done me a huge favor here, Crow. But this isn't over quite yet. Because while the door has been destroyed, my power unfortunately is still trapped in its remains. Forging the door required a piece of my own soul and I needed it back before I could do my job again. That means if we want to end this cycle, someone else has to take down the Lord of Doors. Have you guessed yet? Who? I said that backwards, but it's okay, it made sense, so. I won't be making any more deals again, that's for sure. Head back into your office and reap your boss's soul, crow. And remember, death is on your side. Word. Is that why I keep getting... Maybe that's like a theory as to why he keeps getting brought back to life. Hmm? Okay, let's see what happens when we enter back through the door. I wonder if the Lord of Doors already knows. Oh, they do. My fellow cr Oh no, they're getting assembled! We've arrived at the moment uh, foretold long ago. Today, Death's door has been opened and Death themselves has been freed once more into the world. Fear not, for this is not the end of days, but the beginning of a bright new future. The forces of life and death have been naturally thrown into chaos for a thousand years, and we crows played a hand at that. We must right our wrongs. We must accept our fates. We must reject those who have led us into a future with no hope. It's time for the Lord of Doors' reign to end and for us to return to a natural life cycle. Even as our world tethers on the edge of oblivion, souls like these forest spirits still manage to emerge through the cracks. And soon a new age will begin and the world will teem with new life. Ooh. For that to happen, the final hours of this foretold day must play out as ordained. The crow that freed death will have to end the Lord of Thor's reign. His face is all. Oh, the biggest dontaron! <laughs> that was the biggest dontaron, was it? I have no doubt you'll complete your task, old friend. Have faith in yourself. Uh, do I have enough to upgrade? I have enough to upgrade my final haste. Yes, I do. Ah, I got a trophy specialist. 
I feel like my whole world is crumbling beneath my feet, but somehow I also feel hopeful for the first time, and actually I think this is the first time I've felt hope. Maybe I won't have to work so hard anymore. Because you'll be dead. Duh. <laughs> All of this death and rebirth. I, I think everyone here is sick of what the world has become. A new world, a new star. I wonder if there'll be new TV shows too. So I guess that we're all going to be out of our job soon. Finally, I could be free of the rat race. I never wanted to be a reaper, you know. It was just a matter of necessity. I wonder what I could do next. I guess the endless possibilities lie ahead. Because it all depends on you finishing your job without getting killed in the process. I reckon you'll get it done, kid. Thank y'all for y'all's support. I kind of missed one over there, but it's okay. All right, let's see what happens when we pass through Big Mama door. Oh, Lord. Oh yeah, I remember coming through here. I came from that side though. Oh, well let's see what he's up to. Oh, he's just he's just there. I thought we would have to go through like a whole world. I've been watching you, young crow. I never really thought it would come to this, yet here we are. Each of my kind are created by the Lord preceding them and trained to take over their duties before they pass on. On the day we were created, they, we were told the day on which we would die. Wow, dang. Could you imagine? My predecessor, my creator, was a very cold-hearted tyrant. Obsessed with rules and orders and how things had to be. The old fool could have never given me a name. You, could you believe that? That's why he's just the Lord of Doors. He's not, he doesn't have a name. Oh. How would your life play out if you knew the exact day you were going to die? Every moment of your existence revolved around its ending. I had to do everything in my power to save myself. I know my actions are not entirely moral, perhaps not even justifiable, but I cannot just let myself die. I refuse to go without a fight. So young crow, you ready for the fight of your life as I am for mine? <gasps> oh, sh oh, oh, we're going right into it? Oh, shit! Uh oh, he's gonna have multiple phases. He's gonna be the only boss with multiple phases. Is this the end? I don't want this to be the end of the game, y'all! Wow, I didn't see that coming. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. The, the bull, that's actually pretty sick. That's really sick, actually. I dig that. Oh, we're changing terrain? This is so sick! Uh, one of these bulls is gonna be right off. Oh god. I like this. I. Oh god. Woo! I barely made that without getting hit. Oh my lord. Oh my lord. Oh what? Ah, oh, two hits. Oh my lord. I should have got out of there for free. Come here. Yeah. Come down, ho. Let's go. Oh, what? He did a snap crackle of the pop of the... of the... He does that on the second one, it seems like? Oh god! That is not what I wanted to happen. He's got so much health! I only have one health, no! I'm gonna die! Yeah. I love this. This is so cool. Damn! I I hugged the hell out of that bus. Oh lord, it's gonna it, it's gonna be a while before we kill him because we're going through all of the other worlds. 
Oh god. Oh god. We're going through all of the other worlds. Oh lord. Ah! See, I don't know what causes him to do that, but I don't like it. Me no like you. Me no like you. Woo! I'm, that's why I'm so glad I got haste. Oh, he landed right on me. <laughs> I guess I'm gonna come back when we get back here. Alright, so we're back here at the grove. And I've gone here without being hit, so, and this is only my second try because I'm doing a little quirky stuff like that. Woo! Woo! -woo! Because I, I, I'll, I'll, I'll grapple in and do a couple of swings and then back away. Yeah, that didn't work out so well. Oh god, I messed that up. Oh god, oh no! Dude! Oh god, what the heck? Oh, come on. Come on, dude. Oh. I hope it will saw me back from here because it took a lot to get over here. Jesus Christ. Oh, Lord. Oh, yeah. We're going. 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 Oh, oh, oh. You know, you're eating all these doors. You're eating all these doors? Dodging all these doors. He's eating the doors at me. He's like, you. I just see him, like, snapping these doors into place. Okay, let's see. This is gonna be the snow area. Let's see what you got. Oh, it's the, it's the he, Betty's ability. Ah! Okay, I can deal with that. I can deal with that. Oh, oh man, I missed. It's not worth it to go in. He's getting more and more crack though. He's getting more and more crack though. It's, it's good to not be greedy. It is. Being not greedy goes a long way, I'm telling you. Woo! Woo! I, I'm gonna I'm eat that ass out for breakfast, what? <laughs> oh, that was totally on him. I call bull bull. I like this one. I can deal with this one. I can deal with this one. Is he gonna snap the door? Oh, okay. That must mean we only have one more face of something. Please, dear Lord. Forgive my soul. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, I have to be ready for anything. I have to be ready for it. Oh god. Woo! I'm still only at one health. Oh, we're back here? Is everyone gonna help me kill him? They better Oh wait, hold on, what if the telephone works? Hold up. And I have full health? Oh, let's go. Let's see, come on, please work. Please work, oh. It's not even gonna let me call. Uh-uh, it's like, you think you in jail? You think you get a, you get a, you think you get a free phone call? That was cool though. That was definitely a really fun boss. I love that I could just, just transverse wherever. Oh God. What did he do with everybody? Why are we here, Crow? Why do I exist? To follow in the footsteps of the Lords before me? To repeat the same things over and over? To what end? What is the point if we all have to die eventually? I suppose I'll never know. Because I will never die. Ah. Oh, what is he doing? Oh, he's pulling all the souls out? Oh, he's eating. He's eating them for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. 
A three course meal right behind him. Oh god. The last lord? Oh yeah. We're doing this. Oh god, okay, what it we're I just wanna see that his attack pattern's the same. Oh, it's a fusion of all of them. Okay, that's dope. I dig that. I dig this. Oh god. What was that? Oh, oh god! It was wavy. It was wavy. What are you doing? Come back down here. Oh, oh, I remember. I remember, uh, who, who was like this guardian of the door? He's like a fusion of all the bosses. I guess that's the point, huh? I guess that's the point. He's, he's a little bit of all the bosses. Oh god, I don't know what causes him to do that. <laughs> oh, the tail end of it! Oh crap. <laughs> Woo! He looks like he, he's gonna- oh, his health is gonna take forever. Oh god. Woo! He, he, does, he does like a ceiling jutsu or something. Okay, we got this. Ain't no thing. Ain't no thing. Uh, ain't, uh, ain't no thing. Oh, God. I'm kind of, I'm kind of getting greedy and like. Like going in for doubles. Woo! Oh! 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 I'm fucking stunned! Ah! Oh! How did I not get hit there? I don't know. We don't. Ah! Oh my God! How am I not getting hit? I do not know. Okay, the pools and the laser. Okay, We're, we got this. We got this. We got. Uh, we don't got this. We don't got this support. I didn't have enough distance. You see. So I guess we're gonna just continue from where I died, so. But, oh god, the boy. These are always like 50-50. I can possibly get hit, or I can possibly not. Oh my god. Oh, god, Jesus. Please, no. Please, Lord, have mercy on my soul. Oh my god, okay, it's happening. Everybody stay calm. What's the procedure, everyone? What's the procedure? Oh! Oh! I feel like you should be dead. Excuse me, bitch. It's like curving like this. I'm like, I don't know which way its trajectory is. Oh, we're getting close though. Yeah, yeah it's so much better to roll into it than it is to like. Oh, okay. this is the one. This is the one. This is the one. This is the one. I'm saying it now. He's gonna die right now. Okay, and then he's gonna do his little that. You just roll into it. Oh lord. Even if I get hit right here, I still have one more chance to get hit. Okay, we did that beautifully. And then he's gonna turn into a roly poly, because he's a basic hoe. I thought we were dead, or uh, not dead, but I thought we were getting hit there. Woo! Oh no. 
Oh my god, can you die? Oh, thank god! Thank god, yes! My hands are so clammy. I was at one. I was at one. Please, forgive me. His lights just went out? Oh! Oh! That was weird. It was like a light bulb inside. Today we mourn the passing of a being who shaped the very fabric of our world. The end of a lineage. The last lord of doors. <gasps> and you know, sorry, my camera, I know, died because I was fighting him. I fought him like, just as much as the crow, to be honest. I didn't die more than the crow. To some, they were a mysterious leader. Oh, it's so quiet. To others, a dark cloud looming over the world. Driven by desire to be greater than their creator. Or the one before them. They will be remembered for their part in the advancement of door technology. Their ability to maintain order in a dying world. Their unwavering determination to evade death, no matter the cost. So I'm not, if I if I call someone like, hey, you remind, you remind me of the Lord of Doors. Be like, you sound like someone who's like afraid of death, basically, right? Yeah, yeah, you is. Their pursuits may have been unwise, but the will to live is deeply ingrained. Who's to say what any of us would have done, given the same choices as this Lord? Mm. Bow your head in remembrance and pay your last respects. Their time in this world is over. <gasps> I get that! I like how he winked before he did it. Oh, <gasps> What's gonna happen? Annihilation, it's like an atomic bomb. <sighs> Kills everybody in the premises. That'd be crazy. <gasps> Death's door, oh! I'm so shook. I am shocked because I didn't know this was gonna be the finale. For some reason, I thought there was gonna be another world that the Lord of Doors was gonna have. Oh, and we get to see all of them do their little thing. Oh, that's sweet. I forget the, I, I remember the bard and obviously the chef and the, what's his name? Like Bryant or something like that. Mother's the forest, and they're just in that jam out. Uh, uh. You know, okay, so I gotta say my thoughts, okay? Oh, why is the thing in Pot's head, though? And Pot's... Is Pot's head really the one that's being boiled right now, and that's another pot they're using? I'm just saying. But again, another game by Devolver. Let's not forget. I think it was a great... I would definitely rate it, like, an 8.5 out of 10. Um, I probably would rate it a 9 or higher if I had gone back and actually retraced my steps because half of the game is actually finding all those secrets. I never did any of them, but hint hint, by the time this goes live, I'm probably going to be live streaming the, you know, the platinum for this game because I do that for all my other games. Like I did my tome, like I did Shovel Knight, like I've done so many other games. So then I'll probably appreciate the game a lot because it's like, I bet you there's secret characters, there's secret, the shrines, and I know this much, there's a secret weapon. Can you believe that? And apparently it's like way better than the hammer, which I used like half of the time there. So that's pretty sick, I think. But yeah, I thought I thought the story was pretty cool. I thought it was pretty interesting that we never got our soul back, if anything. Same with the old burp. God bless, you know, imagine you wasted your whole life looking for your soul just for it to not ever come back. And it says, thank you for playing. Yes, you are welcome. It was a pleasure. But I'd be mad as hell too. You looked old. Oh, the graves are carrying away the statue. Oh, he's leaving it behind a key? <gasps> Oh, Crow Gamer, what is that? I guess, hold on, we'll, we'll see a little bit. Let's see what everyone has to say. Well done, friend, I never doubted you for a second. Take to some time for the world to heal and the order of nature to be restored. The crows will aid the process in any way we can. 
And look at they're all here. Look at he's even here. While we no longer have access to the soul vault, I can still access soul energy to enhance your combat abilities. That's cool. It seems there's 13 shrines. See? I'm missing a lot. I'm missing a grip. And as we can see, some of the doors are shining. Like, what is that? I don't know what that's about, but let's let's go pick up this key. I found a rusty bell tower key. The Lord of Doors may have dropped it. Oh. Well, I guess that's a good cliffhanger because I'm going to end it there. I thought it was a great place to end the finale of Death's Door. I can't believe I did it tonight of all nights. I really shook myself. What? Okay, here we are. And I hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay as just as much as I did. And so please smash that thumbs up button if you did. Um, I hope you have a nice morning, evening, or night. And until next time, see y'all out.